We were made to be fully known and fully loved, with no fear of rejection, to walk with a loving Father, not to serve a distant God. Do you ever think, if God really knew me, then He wouldn't love me? The truth is, God does know you, and He does love you. Psalm 1611 captures this when it says, in His presence, we will experience the fullness of joy. Think about this. In Jesus, you're fully known. God knows everything about you. You're both fully known and fully loved. In fact, Jesus is the one who knows you the best and loves you the most. And because of what Jesus has done, you can come boldly into God's presence. You no longer need to be ashamed and you don't have to be afraid. Have you ever felt far from God? Like maybe you see God as a distant, angry, out to get you taskmaster waiting for you to mess up. These perceptions can be developed as a result of life's experiences or your relationship with your earthly father. The truth is that God is a loving, good father. Out of the many names he has, God desires most the name of father. And the truth is, he's never far from you. The truth is, God will never leave you. The truth is, God will never forsake you. The truth is, you're as close to God as you wanna be because he's already chosen to come near to you. He's right here. He's not somewhere far off making you go find him. No matter what you've done, no matter where you've been, there's no condemnation for those who are in Christ Jesus. Because of what Jesus has done, because you are a beloved son and a beloved daughter, you're always welcome home. In Jesus, God's not mad at you. Religion says, I messed up, I need to hide from God. But grace and relationship says, I messed up, I need to run to my father. Jesus came to destroy every barrier between you and God, to reconcile your relationship with God, and now you can freely experience His presence.